Don't stop, turn off the lights, nauseous, when now I'm ranting, let's go. Okay, so those of you who are coming back to my channel, sorry about the lighting, but girl, I'm gonna have to just work with it right now. So thank you so much for coming back. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Those of you who are new, please do the same thing. You are more than welcome here um, with Queen Wells. And um, yeah, if you wanna see what I was up to, oh my camera, I, I, I'm a Libra, I'm organized. I get so upset and pissed when things in minds are lost. But, okay. Anyway, keep on watching. Okay, guys. So, I just have a bunch of eclectic things right here that I'm just going to show you that I have um, picked up. Some of them I got from AliExpress. Some of them I got from Dee Dee's. Um, and most of them, I believe, well, no not DDs. I got these from Ross. So, um, and then I got one thing from, um, the favorite, favorite stool with the frown. I guess you can say the, oops, the smile. <laughs> anyway, so let's open these up first. Um, you know, you guys, I have started back a low workout um, since my back surgery, um, I actually, I will show you a clip of my uh, appointment because pretty much my doctor kind of videotapes everything. I'll put his information um, below. He's a neurosurgeon here in Arizona. He was very, very informative um, about what I need to do, what I don't need to do. So some things that I'm used to doing like on my on a hyper extension machine um, or bench rather. Um, I like to work on my core. Right now I can't do that because I can't bend. Well, I can bend over. It's just going to continue to cause me pain um, because my nerve needs to uh, get back into the groove of things. And until then I have a bone that caused the cyst that they needed to exasperate. And the bone sits like this, but should sit like this. But my bone sits like this. So it's off. And every time I bend over, it just slides to the front. And then when I sit back up, it slides to the back. So if I do that motion, it just rubs. And it's that rubbing that actually, um, causes cause that cyst to form so we don't want to do that repetitive motion uh he has me on a little routine type thing um to see if he can get that uh little i think it's c5 or something c5 or c6 get that uh bone where it's not making that motion but anyway that's enough of that Okay, so that's why I'm nice and relaxed down here. And I have on this little skirt. You guys, if you watch my other um, uh, little thing, you saw this skirt came from Nordstrom's Rack. And you know I absolutely love it. This top also came from Nordstrom's Rack, believe it or not. But it's an older top that I have. And I just have on my pasties with these of course you know i love those they come in handy especially when you're wearing these tops um and you, you know you just don't want a bra sticking out i don't like that look and this is a racer back shirt so and then it's sort of racer in the front which i really like um you can pull this down but it is going to rise up but the girls are sitting up nice and you know perky not perky but nice and the skirt is, of course, absolutely cute. I love it. That's what it looks like from the side. And that's the back. Um, if you watch that video, it'll show you where I got this skirt from. It is absolutely beautiful. So let's get into this. I did a purge. <laughs> a purge. I got rid of a whole bunch of stuff and gave it to veterans. Um, I love getting my, giving my items to them because 
girl. They are fighting for my liberties and I'm gonna fight with whatever I have to make life comfortable for them. To a certain extent, girl, to a certain extent. Okay, so I gave away um, some of my workout clothing that I was not probably going to wear or they were too small, too big. So I got rid of those. I got rid of bras. Girl, I got rid of a whole bunch of stuff. Shoes, you know, I had over 300 pairs of shoes. I have tapered down that, that nonsense, for real. I'm getting chunky heels, very low heels. So some of my big, most of my big heels I've given away. But anyway, so on Amazon, I saw these and you know i am getting away from the um the tapered well the taper and skinny jean girl booty just a little bit out of control for all that grabbing and hugging so i'm i'm getting into the loose and sexy i love that freaking look i just do it's comfortable it's just you know wide leg pants uh, what is it? Gelatos. I love those. So anyway, they had these on here and I've seen people wearing them. I got this. I'll put the information below. I got this in a size medium, I believe. This is from Sukis. Um, yeah, that's what it says. Sukis. Okay, and I got them in this color. Now, this is a wide, not wide leg, but a little bell bottom ish pant um, to work out in. I just thought this was cute. Not only to work out in, but if you're going to the store, girl, toss something on. I just thought this was really, really nice. It has a nice little hard stretch to it, meaning it's going to hold you in where you need to be held in. And I love the back of it. It has that little dip, which I think is flattering to the tush. Um, and I got these in a medium. Let me just double check, make sure. Cause sometimes girl, I will get a large. I got this in a medium. And I just like this color. I thought it would look pretty on my skin tone. It's sort of like a burnt orange. And yeah, I just kind of, like the look, it's not tight at the bottom, it's kind of loose. I can toss these on to go to the gym, go to, from the gym to somewhere else, to brunch, whatever. So I just got this one pair because I wanted to try them out. I forgot how much they were, but I'll put that information below. <coughs> and then, from oh, actually these, this is from DD's. I see the freaking tag right here. So. I picked this little dress up. Now, it's made out of cotton. It's really, really soft. What I was kind of drawn to, it has a beautiful little flower pattern on it. And it's cotton. Who the hell goes wrong with cotton? Um, and it ties up in the, uh, it ties in the front so you can actually make it a little bit tighter around your waist if you want to. I wouldn't do that. I actually like the way it is. It buttons up at the top. Um, it has like four little buttons at the top, which I thought was really cute. And it comes to about mid uh, thigh, what well, most close closer to your um, your knee, but you know, who 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 really cares? And guys. This is just a really, really cute dress. I was impressed with it. Um, it just, you know, kind of gave me that little flowy feeling when you're walking somewhere, it's just gonna blow in the wind. You can wear this with a nice pair of heels or you can stick this on with some nice little, um, you know, some nice little uh, flats. Now, let me see. This, I, oh, I had one of the arms in there. Okay, so the arms come like a T length, so just just below the, the elbow, but really, really, really cute. This skirt, I mean, this dress was $9.99, which I thought was worth it. $9.99 for a nice cotton um, dress. Yeah, that's perfect. Now, I 
would have loved had to have gotten some girl i'm still looking for some pockets i would have loved to have gotten some little pockets on this i just think this is really cute um totally that dress you can wear to the beach or you can wear to the pool with a nice bathing suit underneath it this just goes everywhere so go check out dds you have to be you know you have to be choicy about what you pick up girl because it got a lot of polyester in there and polyester can be your friend don't get me wrong but cotton lets you breathe girl so Mm, I am all in for. So another little thing I picked up from, I believe this is also, yeah, this is also Dee Dee's. Um, I, sh I got this shirt in a, uh, a small, I should have got it in a medium because it has no stretch to it. But it's such a beautiful color. It's such a beautiful color. I like these little, I like the contrast between the straps and the body of the, the little shirt. Um, this is a cottonish kind of polyester fabric. I'm not sure, but it does have a lining in it. I thought that was super cute. So if I chose not to wear my pasties, I would be okay, girl, <laughs> but I would. So let's just get that out there. Um, but if you didn't want to, you'd be okay. I can actually wear a regular bra with this one. I've already tried it on because the straps are nice and thick. And girl, you have to remember when they put those damn darts in there for your boobs, they are not realistic. I mean, even the youngest, youngest, I mean, you gotta be like 12 for your boobs to be that damn high. I mean, it's given, but it's not realistic for a woman's boobs to be i guess maybe if you're 12 or 13 but once you start getting in your teens girl gravity <laughs> you know they're still perky don't get me wrong but you know gravity gets to well, let's stop talking about boobs okay so this is really cute this shirt is 4.99 and i thought it was worth 4.99 now i was disappointed in the darts as always however you know, I have been known to turn a damn shirt around <laughs> to the opposite side. This one I cannot, because if you notice, it's rounded off in the front and it's less rounded in the back. So this is a cute shirt. Just put on a nice bra with it and it's going to be absolutely perfect. To go with that skirt, I went ahead and I got these little um, pants. Now these are a cotton polyester again and it's i might might be getting the cotton but it's not a true polyester it's mixed um and these came from dd2 they were 7.99 i love the fit of these pants and let me tell you why number one they are wide leg not too wide not the super wide leg ones but it's got a decent little girth to it at the bottom. The next thing I absolutely love about these pants is that they have a thick, probably about a three inch um, little uh, waist belt to them. And I love that. I love that look because it gives you a kind of sophisticated look with the high um, high waistband. And if you wear a belt or without, I would not wear a belt with this unless I maybe put in just a belt for accent, not to hold pants up, but a nice accent belt like a silver or a red, nice and thin. That would look really, really pretty with this. Um, it has two clips and it's nice and just, it just screams like they're designer pants and they're not. They have faux pockets in the back and you know how I feel about my pockets. Even the faux ones in the back. I don't usually put anything in the back, but the faux ones look good. And if you actually look at this pant, it gets a little wider at the hip, which you know I need. You know I need it. So I 
I absolutely love that. They have faux pockets in the front as well with a little button, which is a nice quality button. I mean, you know, sometimes they give you these little plastic buttons. This is a real little um, kind of like a shell type button on these, which is really cute. I am here for it. Um, I love these pants. I think they're gonna look really, really nice with, um, with the shirt and because of the material it's going to fall really nice on a super cute pair of heels i would even put a nice chunky heel with these i'm thinking i bought a, a pair of chunky heels i believe i got them right here oh uh, these came from nordstrom's rack they were 69 bucks but this little heel would look cute with those pants um I wish I would have gotten this in a, not necessarily a patent leather. I have a gray pair from Steve Madden. It's also a patent leather. The heel is not as chunky as this one, but this one would look good with that pants too. Um, so check out those with Steve Madden's. The next thing I picked up, and this was from Nordstrom's, um, I put, no, this was from from Ross. So this is the one thing I got from Ross. So I picked up this skirt. Now, yes, it's glittery, but it's just a cute skirt. It looks like a super mini, but believe it or not, guys, it is not a super, it is not a super mini. It would even go good. Let me, let me just try the skirt on for you. Just, just hold please. Okay, so look at this skirt. It is just super cute. It is not super short. I mean, you know, unless you get to pulling it up there, which I never wear my skirts up there. I always wear them just below my little belly button. And um, it's kind of big, but it's it's okay. I like this skirt. It just, it, it's just like, you know, I'm not doing too much. I can wear this to the club and, you know, you it's just it looks even looks good with this top. I wouldn't wear this top with it, but yeah, it even looks good with this. And it just gives this pretty now you can see girl, I'm pulling this down already. So this is gonna rise up on when you walking. It's it's gonna do some, you know, it's gonna do some rising, but I mean, even with me walking like that. That's about the rising it'll get. And that's okay. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. That's okay with me. I can I can go with that. Yeah. I mean, just look. Look at the design. It makes it look just really, really pretty. Yeah, I'm gonna look in the mirror. I like it. It's just, it's just iridescent. It's just iridescent. It's a pretty freaking skirt. Okay, so enough of that. So I'm just gonna keep this on, but I'm not trying to show you no goodies. I'm just gonna turn sideways. Okay, so the next thing I got was this little um, outfit here. Now, these are the Pilates, I believe they call them pants, so this came with a little top and girl um it'll be a lot of under boobage with this but <coughs> i probably would try it on but i i mean this is how i would wear the, a top like this and you can see already i can feel my under boobage so I mean, I would have to move this down like that. Girl, I don't even know. I don't know if that's going to work for me, but I ain't going to worry about that. Um, okay, so let me show you the pants first. Um, I had put together a little outfit and everything, girl. I was going to do this up. This is the little necklace. It's just cute.
cute. I, it's in a kind of burnt type copper. And I hope you can see that. Yeah, it's cute. Um, so yeah, I'll try that out. But let me just show you everything else. So these are the pants. Now, they have a wide uh, elastic on this. I would have loved to have had this with a, um, and they have, you know, they have it where it has a little belt, belt hoops, but I would have loved, absolutely loved, and I was just looking to see if I could change that, this elastic to a nice little, um, you know, a, a nice little uh, band that's actually made out of cloth. I just think this would just be really, really cute to have a wide band like that. But this, of course, does have the super wide legs. Um, I don't think these actually um, are going to drag the ground on me. I would have liked them a little bit longer. I got this in a medium. I should have gotten a large. Now, the reason why I didn't is I'm going to show you because it comes with a little vest type, well, jacket, swear, I don't know what you want to call it, but yeah, it comes with that. And if I'd have got it in a medium or a large, girl, that would have been dragging the ground and that's not cute. So, um, these will touch the ground, but not drag the ground. But I like these. I just like this freaking look. Um, so yeah, let me just put these on for you real quick. Like, since I'm trying stuff on anyway. Girl, these damn things don't even have a tag in it. How the hell am I supposed to tell <laughs> from, from the back? I put on the right top for sure. This top is going on with everything. Oh, girl, you can see me in the mirror. Sorry about that. I'll just block that out. <laughs> I'm looking in the mirror. Okay, these are cute. Again, I wear my pants just like I wear my skirts. Just a little up, just at the belly button. But this is how the pants look. Again, these were dragged around just a little bit. So I think that's cute, but yeah, I like these pants. Shoot, they go with the hair doing everything. Um, I'll tell you this damn elastic is super freaking tight. I mean, go, it's giving me a a waist wedgie or something. But yeah, these are cute. Now, this is what I was talking about. Okay, so these pants. These, these pants are great, but it's the little vest that they give you. Now, let me see. They gave you this little belt that can go on the pants. I don't, I don't know if I would wear it on the pant, but girl, let's just try it out. Let's just try it out. It's like almost 11 o'clock and I'm up doing the damn video. You know, old people is being in the bed right about now. But we we getting there, we getting there, we are getting there. Okay, so then it has two in the front. Okay, so this is how the little, little belt would go, whatever. Look, I gotta take this jacket off because it is super, super, yeah. Girl, this thing is killing my waist. Let's see. Even if you wore them, ooh, girl, that's too high. <laughs> that's, how, that's how my grandmother used to rock out. <laughs> anyway, okay. <clears throat> the next thing I'm going to show you has nothing to do with clothing, but I'm going to share it with you anyway because we were talking about hair when we first started. So, I got this, I think off of Amazon, if I'm not. Yeah, I think I got this off of Amazon. Cause I actually ordered uh, some braids 
with um wig lynn i think that's her site i'll put her out i'm actually going to be trying all those on so i'll put because i got three um that i braided wigs that i'm going to be trying on um hers by far is the best it is partially made out of i don't girl i don't know if that's totally human hair or partially human hair but i bleached it not so i know it's human hair at the top um yeah, it is absolutely freaking beautiful. It's 36 inches long, which I love. It, the, it's just not heavy. It's just a beautiful made. It's not straight back. It's just got a beautiful design to it. Yes, girl, I'm feeling that hair piece. So anyway, I'll give all her information when I put the hair piece on. So let me just show you this one. And this one, you get a little... um wig cap i don't think you need it uh but girl i just go ahead and collect them um it is not my color but it's free um so this is a 1b right there 1b amazon got some stuff on it girl yes they do so this is this little one and let me tell you about this i had one like this before which kind of threw me off um, because they tell you that uh, when you look at the description, it tells you that it is a full lace wig. Well, yes. However, which the reviews don't tell you that Queen is Cassie is going to tell you now. It has this little net in here and i don't know i'm assuming that the net is over the because i wouldn't even want to cut it to find out but i'm tempted to uh because i want to know if the hair is actually attached to this little which i don't think it is however it looks like it is but let me show you Okay, so it has a, let me take this off because it's got hella baby hair on here. And I, you can't see it if I don't take this off. The braids are really pretty. They are really lightweight. They are synthetic though. And I can tell by the feel and the weight of the hair. So actually, wigglin those are actually going to be real hair because it's a little heavy um heavier than this this is all synthetic but it's really really cute it has it's plaited all the way to the ends i probably would um these ends are pretty but they are just too uniform for me they are twisted at the ends um, so not plaited, but they are twisted at the ends. It's all plaits at the top. But let me just, let, first of all, let me show it to you like this. Okay, so this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like in the back. That's really pretty. I really like it. Oh, girl. I really like it. I, of course, probably would just do a little curl at the bottom of this so that's my plan to it it's just to you know put it on a little um roller stick it down in some hot water and go ahead and curl it but that is just it's really really pretty it's well made in the back the plat the plaits are very uniform now let me just give you an up close look so you can see what i'm talking about so you see Right here is just really, really pretty. You can definitely, you know, it, the, you know, you can definitely pull this up because it's plaited all the way to the back. This is the back, and even in the back, it gives you a little bit of um, lace, so you can actually lay that down in the back if you choose to. And then it has a comb in the back as well. And it has um, little clips that you can clip on. And then, hold on. 
the little clips that you can clip. Hope you can see that, guys. And then it also has a non-slip. You see that? I like that. You know, so it's a well-made unit and you can adjust this and it can actually be glueless, which is what how I would wear it. And this is the pattern. Let me show it around. There's a cute little pattern in the front, which I absolutely freaking fell in love with. I actually love that pattern. Can you see that? That's just really pretty. And it goes, you know, it, it just, it's just there on the top and then the rest of it just goes in it. But that's just, that was just cute and pretty to me. Now, let me just show you this. It gives you baby hair and you get the net, the, you know, the lace up front. And it's not really hard lace. It's a nice soft lace. However, in it, you get this little net now i don't know if the i the hair is connected to the net or because i can actually separate it a little bit where that little cloth is so i'm just inquisitive can i take that off <laughs> and i'm gonna let you guys know because i just think if you take that off at the top this is going to look so much freaking better. You know I'm going to do it. <laughs> I am going to take this off just so I can see what the freaking looks like. But anyway, guys, that is all I have for you today. <laughs> I hope you found some type of inspiration off of my ranting and my dad. Anyway, this is Just the Queen Wells. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching this video. As always, I love you guys and good night.